Sick reactor here. Uh, yeah, new background. I know, new background. Don't mind it. Uh, but you know what? Let me know down below if you like the other one or you like this one. This is the basement. The other load uh, background is my room. So let me know which one you like. Um, I think this one basically brings out a lot of fucking space, and the other one just the corner. But you know what? Let me know down below if you like the basement or the room better. But yeah. The reason why we're making this video is because the FIFA World Cup is just around the corner. I have released a video of who's gonna win the World Cup. And some of you say, some of you disagree with my opinions. And, uh, we're ranking kits, okay? Fuck, <laughs> that's, that's another. Alright, so we're gonna be ranking kits. Netherlands. Netherlands. Okay, same thing with the France, uh, France situation. Uh, that shade of orange does not look good at all i do not like that shade of orange <sighs> but it looks nice i'll give it a 5.9 i'll give it a 5.9 that blue one looks amazing too looks great um but i'll give it i'll, I'll wear i'll give it a um 6.5 the away kit's better than the home kit just because that orange just doesn't look good i i do not like that orange at all so the host, the host Qatar, uh, same thing with the Canada thing, pretty standard, um, I don't know why the fuck can Qatar, like, out of all the countries, that would be the middle one, like, weird, but, uh, yeah, I think Qatar, it, they did, they had to do justice with Qatar, they couldn't do Qatar dirty, because they're hosting it, so I think I'll give Qatar white jersey a, uh, a 6.9 and a red one, I'll give it a, I'll give it a 7.1 to be honest, it looks nice. Ecuador, 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 Ecuador. Um, it looks fire bro, it looks, but they gave the three options. Um, I think I'll give, I have to make three predictions for these, um, the yellow one looks like the blue one, I'll give it a yellow one. 7.8 the blue one it does have that patterns which i like a lot i'll give it a 7.6 and the white one straight up white one 7.6 as well senegal's world cup kit i don't know i don't know why like literally i don't know why they decided to make this fucking thing like what is that shit like what is that shit bro like what is that what, what, what makes you think that little square or that little fucking circle, whatever shape in that fucking middle, Puma national team number, that's just, just, I do not like it at all. I hate it. I'll give it a 4.3 because it, it, it at least brings closer. That white tee though looks amazing. I like it a lot and I would wear it. I would wear it, but I'll give it a uh, 7.8. Standpoint. I like that. I fuck with that white one heavy, bro. That white one looks nice as fuck. Alright. The United States, bro. The United fucking States. Like, oh my god. Did the board unite and said this is one of the greatest kits in America? Because that is just terrible. Jeez, bro. Oh my god. Especially that blue one. Like, I hate the fucking kits, bro. Oh my god. Like, who the fuck said, who the fuck said, this America kit looks so fucking fire. And then that little fucking thing on the fucking neck, I hate it, I fucking hate it. Both kits, I'll give it a fucking point one. I hate it, bro, I hate that fucking kit. I really do. Does not represent America in the slightest. Oh, actually, it does. How terrible it is, like, how terrible the fucking economic structure of America right now is, yeah. I'll, I'll give that, but besides the point, it's just ugly. Like, if it's gonna represent America, might as well represent the fucking economic structure right now because it's terrible, straight up terrible. England, England's shirt, England's shirt, England's shirt. That white, that white one. Man, does not look like that. Does not look like a fucking. That does not look like a fucking. Kit. It looked like a preseason kit. Like everyone been saying that, and I completely agree. It looked like a fucking training training top before you actually see the the real one. Like I do not like that one. Do not like it at all. Like 
I just, it, I swear, look, if England's training kit looks more like a national, like a, the, it looks like a national team kit, then what the fuck, bro? Like, literally, what the fuck? Like, I think you're, I think the design team, like, accidentally gave them the training kit instead of the actual kit. But I don't know, bro. I don't know what's up with, uh, I don't know what's up with Nike. I'll give the white one, I'll give it a six. The red one looks nicer. Um, I don't know, bro. I'll give it a 7.4. Looks nicer, bro. Looks nicer. Wales. Uh, yeah, looks pretty standard, to be honest. That red one looks fire. That white one, same thing with the fucking, the, the behind the scenes. This one doesn't like it. But, uh, looks fire. Pretty standard, but for the red one, I'll give it an 8. For the white one, I'll give it a 7.7. That World Cup kit uh, for Iran, I fuck with it. I would, I would wear it. I would wear it. It looked like literally like a fucking paintbrush just went through it. The red one here. That's fire. For both of them. For both of them. Fire. So for the red one, I'll give it a, uh, I'll give it a 6.9. The white one, I'll give it a 6.8. You know what, fuck it, I'll give both of them seven. Argentina, Argentina with the blue and white stripes and the away kit and the purple and flames. Now that is a pretty interesting combo. The first one, the blue and white, I think it gives me a lot of vibes from the 2014 World Cup. Uh, it, it, I like that kit a lot, actually. That was a very classic kit. Um, it really does represent Argentina as a whole. Like, of course it will, but uh, like, it brings a lot, you know, and it's and a, and a lot of the expectation of Argentina winning the World Cup, and then they went back to like a recreation of the 2014 World Cup. I like it, and uh, I think I will give it between. I'll, th I'll give it a, a nine, a nine, straight up nine. It, it's really a, a really beautiful. I like it, and the away kit, the purple flames one. Like, I have no idea, bro. The purple flame kit. It, it, I get the aesthetic, I get the idea, like, flames, like, it looks cool, okay, but the purple, it doesn't match, like, I, I wouldn't, I, 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 I don't see it in Argentina to be wearing purple, so I'll give it a 7.5, 7.5, I think it's right up, alright, okay, Saudi Arabia, a finally good kit from, finally a good kit from uh, Saudi Arabia, that green kit, yeah, I mean, I like it. Look, so, I look something like the Matrix, to be honest. Like the space coming down, it's like the Matrix. When the intro and the zeros and ones. But it, I'm not. It's, it looks good, bro. Looks good. But I'll give it a uh, seven point. Fuck it, seven point. I'll give it an eight. The white one looks like if you were to not wash it at all, but you were to not get dirty. Like a, uh, like a dirty white shirt. That, but it doesn't look a dirty white shirt, but it looks nice. Mm. I gave I gave the uh, green one an 8. The white one gets a 7. Poland! Poland. Same thing with the standard is. Um, it looks nice. I, I, I like a, uh, the white one looks like a... It, is, it looks like a polo shirt. But, um... The red one, I'll give it a 6.9, and the white one, I'll give it a um, 6.2. Especially, I like I like shirts with collars, so I, I, it looks nice. I'll give I'll give that to Poland. Mexico. Now this is where a lot of people are gonna disagree with me, but I'll give it this. It's better than the black and red one, bro. It's better than the black and red one for sure, but it's not for me. I do not like it. I don't like it. It does represent culture and other things like that, but I just don't like it. The white one, on the other hand, now that was bomb. I'll give it a straight 9.9. But I the the green one, bro, the green one for me does not cut it. I do not like it. I give it a five. I'll give it a five because for me, I just doesn't cut it. And that white one looked bomb, but the green one just doesn't look good for me. I I know people are not uh, people are not gonna agree with that. A decision or opinion but it's just for me i wouldn't take it i wouldn't buy it the white one amazing uh australia australia with that yellow kit yellow and green kit like uh, it's beautiful um 
I think it's unique. Um, I think I'll give it a, a 6.7. 6.7. I think it's straight up 6.7. Uh, they, they, they were the last team to qualify for the World Cup. Uh, uh, they, they're one of the... I think they're one of the worst teams in Australia to qualify. But, you know, they give it... A, they, they, they basically made it into the World Cup. The blue kits. It's because of... Man, I'll, I'll be honest with you, bro. Nike did terrible. Like, I'm gonna straight up tell you this. If it's an Adidas kit, it's pretty, pretty straightforward, and I like it. It's pretty good. Nike just did fuck all. Like, it's just I don't like all of Nike's kits, bro. This World Cup Nike kit is just terrible. Like, it's just terrible. It's, I'll give this one this. I wouldn't wear this. Like, I would not wear this. Like, especially that yeah, the thing on the call. Like, what does that mean? Like, what is that? That's just ugly. If I was like the director of kits and my designer bring me this type of colorway, like this type of fucking formation for every kit, I would fire him right away. Like, I hate that. I hate that. Like, one of the Spurs. I hate the Spurs kit as well. Like, the Spurs kit. I hate it. This shit. I hate it. Like, I don't. The color looks fine. It's just the fucking formation of the kit. I just hate it. And for that, I'll give it a 4.3. 4.3, to be honest. Going on. France, y'all. France. Uh, golden Nike logo with the golden Nike, with the golden France logo. Like it, because they're obviously the champions, so of course they gotta wear the gold. Uh, but it's a straight up, it's basically like a blue shirt. I think it's one of the worst blues. They could have chosen. I think a darker blue would have been more nicer, but I don't know. Navy blue. I don't think that fits them, but it looks great. I, I, I'll be honest. It looks great. The white one, generally, also that one looks great. You know, it looks amazing. The I think it looks good. Kind of giving me that Italy vibe with that bright, uh, that bright blue with the white. Giving me some Italy vibes, but it's fine. I like it. Uh, for the blue, for the home kit, I'll give it up. I'll give it an 8.3. The France white one. I'm going to take off some points because it's taking Italy's identity. So I'll just give it a 7.5. 7.5. That Tunisia, Tunisia World Cup kit looks fire. Um, but it's like same thing like standard for like the Canada thing. Um, white, red. Uh, 6.9 and uh, for the red one. And 6.8. Yeah. Denmark kit looks pretty standard. They I don't know why they didn't decide to add like a little white to the fucking or to the badge or something. I don't know why for the both white, but it looks pretty standard. I'll give both of them I, I, because they're standard red and white, but no fucking color on on the fucking on the badge or the logo. So I'll give it a fucking both of them. I'll give it a fucking five point nine. Germany, 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 Germany. Um, so that Germany kit looks nice. Um, especially that red one. Um, the red one, I will give it a man. Is it? I'll give it a. I'll give it a six point three. Because that, that color does not look good. That that orange yet gold. That that does not look good for me. I I do not like it. And. That white and black one looks decent, but I'll give it a, um, I think I'll give it a 6.1 maybe. I don't know, but it looks nice. It looks nice, but I just, I wouldn't wear it, bro. I wouldn't wear it. That's definitely my opinion. I would not wear that one. Costa Rica. Costa Rica. Um, uh, definitely a bomb ass fucking fire kit. I think it's amazing. That red, blue sleeves. Um, that white one too with the blue sleeves, white shirt. Ba 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 ba. I think I think I think a lot of the I think the non Adidas Pumas and Nike shirts are pretty bomb ass fire, like fucking fire. That Costa Rica shirt is an example of that. New Balance did a great job with that. Um, la 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 la. Eight point nine for the red one and uh, the white one. Eight point. Nine as well. They look great. Basically, both of them are great. Like, they are great. I like it. 8.9 for both. Spain! Spain's national kits. I don't know what is it for me, but that blue one gives me the 2006 World Cup ball. 
vibes, I don't know. I don't know. It looks nice. It just looks nice that uh, the red one looks weird. Um, I don't know what's up with me. I like more away kits and I like more away kits and home kits. <laughs> I don't know, bro. That red kit. I just don't like the fucking the the under the fucking uh, this this fucking thing right there. I just don't like it. But it looks nice to be honest. Um, I'll give it a eight for the red one. The the blue one, I'll give it a eight point three. Japan, bro. Now that one looks straight up fire. I like the white one a lot. The blue one looked fire. I think the Japan one, I'll give it a 8.9. The white one, I'll give it a 8.8. .8. It looks fire. I like that Japan one. Uh, yeah. Canada. Canada looks standard. It's a red red shirt with a white shirt. It's pretty standard, but I, I like that. I mean. It's definitely one of Nike's best kits. Uh, one of Nike's best kits. Um, I'll give it up. I'll give it a seven. Both of them. It's pretty standard, and I like it. But I'll give both of them seven. Croatia, Croatia, like where your design team so fucking lazy to not finish the square pattern. What the fuck, bro? Like what the fuck? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't like that, bro. Like to be honest, you should have just finished the whole thing. Like why the fuck? Like if you wanted to add a a a, a, a section for the logo and kit, that's uh, for the logo and team, that's fine. But do not like it. Do not like it. I do not like it. The blue one, it looks like the. And the blue one looks nice. Looks nicer because it looks like some kind of design. It looks nicer. The blue one looks nicer than the red one. It just. The red one, they didn't decide to finish the whole thing. Like, why? That looked just ugly. Um, the red one, I'll give it a 5.9. The blue one, I'll give it a 6.3. Yeah, 6.3. It's a Belgium red, a red kit with the flames on the on the on the sleeves. I think that's fucking fire. I think I, I want to know how it looks like with the long sleeve. Would it be like? fire from the from the wrist on to like the fucking shoulder like how would that look like but i i sort of like it i like it a lot uh i'll give it a 7.5 you know it's pretty good i like it i like it and the awake it uh it's uh definitely interesting the thing from the the side here it's interesting instead of the flame being on the on the fucking seats on the fucking back side like in this section right here um, uh, I think I'll give it a 6.7, just because of that, but I think everything else looks fine, I like it, I like it, just this part right here. Morocco, 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 these Puma shirts, they are terrible. I don't know why, I don't know what is it, these Puma shirts are terrible, the, the Nike and the Puma shirts are just fucking d disgusting, I do not like that shit at all, for real, I do not like that shit at all. The little circle thing and then the number country logo. I hate that shit. It was definitely him. It, I like I like this thing. I like the colors. I'll give it a four for the white one. And for the red one, man, I'll give it up. I I I'll give it up four point three maybe. Just because it doesn't have that fucking circle shit. Fucking disgusting. Now we are going to Big Boy Brazil. Big Boy Brazil. Uh, that that Brazil kit, man, it looks kind. Of, it looks fire, bro. It looks so fire, bro. I like it a lot. I mean, the the traditional yellow, green, and the blue kit, away kit, looks amazing. Like some people say, like some people say that like, they don't like that that leopard, that leopard uh, sleeve thing, but I. I, I I honestly like it. I mean, the for the for the home kit, I like it too. I'll give it a eight point eight point seven. I like it. Like I, I definitely don't like the color yellow. Uh, the blue one. I'll give it a seven point one. It looks nice, bro. It looks very nice. Like I like that. I like that leopard. I like that leopard thing. Some people say they hate it. Like I, I like it. To be honest, a Puma kit. The Puma kit for the Serbia. What can I say? I fucking hate it. The white one. The red one looks standard, so the red one I'll give it a 
I'll give it a 6.9. The red one, I'll give it a... The white, the white one, I'll give it a 4.3. The red one, I'll give it a fucking 5.9. Okay. Okay, okay Switzerland. Like, is it, is it just a trending topic to just make one shirt, a ma one shirt, basically, uh, basically decent, amazing, decent, and the other shirt just like a fucking camera roll, like, expect this one specifically looks like a fucking camera roll, no fucking disrespect to the country, disrespect to the fucking brand, like, that little fuck, that looks like a fucking camera roll, you're trying to focus, and that little square, they're like, what is that shit? Four, I look at a 3.9, that's just, I don't not like it at all. That red one looks decent. I look at this 6.9. What a why? That blue one gives a lot of retro vibes, especially that ninth, that, especially the first World Cup when they won it. That hit gives a lot of that retro vibe, and I like it. I like that shirt a lot. Um, uh, especially since they color that shade gold. Amazing. Um, same thing again, that fucking away shirt looks disgusting and I do not like it at all. Uh, that white shirt, uh, I'll give it a 4.1. That blue shirt, I'll give it a fucking 7.5. I like it a lot. I like that retro vibe about it. Okay, so Ghana's, Ghana's uh, away shirt, that red shirt looks... Like I, they, okay, so... So basically, they decided just to fucking square that shit up. Some of them were just, some of the designs were circles. Some of them were just square or cut up into sections. Now, this one is a straight up square. I'll give them credit and I'll give them a 4.6 for at least finally fucking squaring that shit up. That white one, uh, I'll give it a 5.9. Mediocre. Uh, I don't know, but it's a straight up white shirt. Portugal! Portugal! Portugal, Portugal. The home kit fucking hated as well. What the fuck is that, bro? Why? What? What? Why? That little slash in the middle dividing the green and the red. That's ugly. I fucking hate that shit. Why? The away kit it looks somewhat normal, but that fucking I do not like it in the slightest. Compare in the, the compare the Portugal. Uh, kits in the past was better than this shit. Like, oh my god, the past five Portugal shirts are way more better than this shirt right like here, and I fucking hate it. I'll give it a two, but I just hate it. That standard one, I'll give it a five because it looks somewhat normal, but I, it's disgusting. It's disgusting. Okay, at least it's better than America. I'll stay. I'll just say that it's better than America. South Korea. With that red, actually, I mean, I mean, let me just look at it real quick. Okay, so that South Korea, that red shirt looks nice, looks nice. Um, one of the best kits here, and that uh, that blue with the with the weird stripes under the red yellow, it it, it looks like one of it's like look at the Vinci just like splash color into it. Like, I get what Nike's trying to do with that. It's decent. Um. For the home kit, the the red kit, I'll give it a um, I'll give it a six point, six point seven. I think six point seven. I like it. It's like a pinkish red. Yeah, that black one, I would wear it. I'll give it a seven point nine. Yeah, I like it. I, I like it. But yeah, that is my World Cup. Uh, my World Cup rankings on the kits. Uh, I think for me overall, this World Cup kits were way worse than the Russia kits, than the Russia 2018 World Cup kits, and the Brazil kits. I think the Brazil kits were amazing. Most of them were amazing. But yeah, let me know down below what you guys think. Uh, I mean, your favorite kits. Uh, let me know who's your favorite one in the World Cup. And I tell, let me know what you're expecting from the World Cup. Um, but yeah, let me, let me head out, but before I do, subscribe, like, and comment, and, uh, yeah, now, I am gonna head out, peace.